Welcome to Black Canyon of the Gunnison National Park. Black Canyon of the Gunnison is one of four national parks in Colorado. This small national park might not be high up on everyone's list, but the views of the deep, narrow canyon are pretty impressive and make this national park worth a visit. We only had a few hours to spend in this park, and here are some of the viewpoints where we stopped to get a feel of the park. So we're here at Gunnison Point. We just talked to the park ranger. We wanted to figure out why is this called Gunnison Point? Why is it called Black Canyon of the Gunnison National Park? And it turns out Gunnison was a military general who was sent here back in the day to figure out if they could actually bring railroads through the area. He arrived, saw the canyon, said no, and he left. And then they named everything after this general. They named the river, the canyon, and the park after this general. Come over here and put your hand on the railing and then look down. <laughs> oh my god, wait. Wow. <laughs> wow. Some of the other areas you get the feeling if you jumped like you would tumble downhill for a long time. It still wouldn't be fun, but here you'd be you'd be getting wet. <laughs> you go all the way down. You can see there's the 60 degree erosion down there though. On the right side, much shallower slope. On the left side, it actually eroded at 93 degrees. If you get to the north rim, you can actually stand on top of the river at a certain point. Um, beyond that, though, there are two different types of rocks, and there's you can see this jagged, like somebody took a knife and like stabbed it, slice, 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 slice into the side. There's the pegmatite dikes, which are the volcanic remnants, which are a bit lighter colored, and they erode a lot quicker than the gneisses, which are dark. As a result of that, the lighter rocks have eroded away, and you're seeing the dark fins stick out of the harder rock that remains. 